Hi everyone and welcome to this tutorial where we're going to draw a little chick that is popping out of an egg and I wanted to draw uh, some surrounding also a little bit of shadow underneath the egg to get a little bit of 3D effect so let's start drawing first you take a pencil and you draw in the shape of the egg itself try to make it as smooth as possible and then first I draw in those little pores that are coming out of the egg here's the left paw you can see the little nails that are on the paws so that's an awesome effect now I want to draw in the chick itself so here is the beak and then there are some large surprised eyes and the hole that he is looking through here is a one wing and here is the other wing and I put in some little cracks in there and as I was saying just underneath that egg I draw in a little bit of shadow Here are the cracks for the feet. And once you have your sketch standing, you can erase the little lines that are not useful anymore. And then you can start coloring in the chick itself. I use a little bit of yellow for the head of the chick and the wings. And a little bit of orange for the beak and the little paws once you have those colors in you can take your fine liner and then you can start drawing out your sketch here you can see the left paw and I'm drawing in the little nails that are on them and also a little bit of uh, little curves in the feet itself and a shadow for the inside of the egg here is the wing and that has a little crack too and now I can finish the surrounding of the egg and I can draw in the little chick itself this is the hole that he is peeping through. Here is the left wing. And then I color in the back of the egg, the inside of the egg, with the black marker. For the shadow underneath the egg, I'm using my graphite. I also drew in the shadow of the little wings, as you can see here. And this is ideal for shadows, because when using graphite or a black color pencil, you can um, fade that out with your finger or a little cotton tip or a blender stick. Around the egg, I also draw in a little bit of grey. In that way, the egg appears more white. And I also use the blender stick to ease out the grey. I also place a little bit of shadow on the lower end of the egg. Now a little bit of extra shadow and your drawing is finished. I hope you will give this a try and I wish you a very happy Easter. Don't forget to subscribe. I hope you will give it a big thumbs up and I will see you again in my next tutorial. 